What is up, all you kinky bitches? You know who it is. And breaking news! Grand Theft Auto Online still sucks, and it doesn't work. Now, this isn't to say that, you know, Grand Theft Auto Online sucks, it just means that the game right now isn't working. So, as a substitute, I decided to try some, you know, Battlefield 4, and surprisingly, I'm kind of in love with this game. I was never a big Battlefield 3 player, I always, you know, I dabbled with it and I had respect for it and I always kind of thought it was fun, but I don't know, man, there's something about this game that I just love and I'm just deciding to play it a lot. You can see right now I've got this crazy shotgun. This thing shoots explosive rounds and I can just run around and dominate. Like, I don't really, you can see I'm just shooting this dude in the face with these, you know, gigantic pine cone, you know, explosives. They're awesome. And I just run around and I just do my thing and that's it really easy and I'm just kind of getting the zone in Battlefield 3 for the consoles I don't know I mean you could play rush and all that stuff but I really like just being able to run around as a soldier and fuck shit up I mean that's what I really like to do I don't like to get in a tank I don't like to get in a helicopter and fly into mountains I don't like that shit I like to run around with a fucking gun like a man and shoot the shit out of people that's what I do so and this game is awesome it has an ACR ACR is like my favorite gun and then I use that PP200 gun too. That gun's fucking awesome. I got this cool ass like desert camo. And there's so many other cool camos that I can rock with too. Which is just, it's just awesome. If you guys haven't downloaded the beta yet, then why the fuck are you watching this video? Just download the beta. It's free. If you don't have enough space, get a flash drive from like your sister's house and plug it into your computer, into your Xbox and use it and download this. And then send me a message so we can fucking play together. Because that would be awesome. But, this is this is a pretty decent gameplay. It was, you know, it's not like I dropped like 40 kills or anything, but I just, I feel like I did pretty well. I, did, I hit a lot of shots, I, and I did my thing. So I figured I'd upload it. This is one of my first gameplays with the uh, ACR, and I really, I, I love this gun. The ACR, it shoots fast. Um, when you have iron sights, it's kind of a pain in the ass. I'm normally not an iron sights player, but the PP200, I actually like, you know, it it's, has iron sights, and I'm, I'm perfectly cool with it. Oh, and you can see this dude, he just got pistol. He just got pistol whip. Could have killed me, didn't kill me. And you and this dude, this guy tried to run away. From me. This guy right here, he tried to run away from me. He was scared because he saw the white ACR camo. And he was like, oh shit, it's him. Time to run away. And he ran away. And now I'm just I'm just I think I was trying to change some settings or check my score just to see how many times I died. But Regardless, I'm just running around and doing my thing. I'm starting to feel this game more and more. I'm kind of a battlefield noob. I'm not a shooter noob. I've played all all the you know big shooters and I've been you know decent at them like Call of Duty, Halo, Gears of War. This is my my big three. But Battlefield, I don't even guys to be 100% honest. I don't even know if I'm gonna get Call of Duty because this game is so awesome and I don't I don't have money to blow. If I'm going to get an Xbox One and all this stuff, I can't, you know, I got to, you know, make sure my budget's nice and neat. And, and right here, by the way, before I go into some crazy long rant, I got kind of stuck as you could, I, saw, I was trying to hop out of that window and it didn't really work. So it was all good though, my teammates came in, they picked me up, and now I'm just running around with a shotgun. I've got no ammo, that's one thing about this game, I don't know if it's going to be like that in the real game, but you run out of ammo so quickly. And part of it is because when you first pick up this game, a lot of people, when they reload their guns, they think that, okay, all the ammo just resets and I get, you know, the fresh clip or whatever. But in this game, they actually made it really realistic, where if you reload, all of the bullets in your clip are gone. So if you shoot five bullets and reload, you just lost the other 20-some-odd bullets that you shot. So you really got to conserve your ammo. you got to figure out when to reload, when's the appropriate time to reload. And by the way... No one on this fucking beta drops any ammo for you. I run around with a pistol so much, it's irritating. Either I'm missing tons of shots and I'm just using a pistol. I had to actually use this shotgun as a secondary. This is the only thing I could do. It's just, it was impossible to get anything done. So I was like, you know what? Fine. Shotgun it is. Boom. Pump action. And I thought this dude was still alive because I saw him on my radar. But no, he was just, you know, being a freaky bitch. And you can see, and I think there's a dude right here. I did a little bunny hop. <laughs> I, I really honestly shouldn't have even died right there. I tried to do some bunny hop, Call of Duty, Halo thing. I'm still getting used to this game. Like, jumping does not work unless you're trying to run away from someone. This guy just got outgunned, by the way. You forget that guy. He just got outgunned. But, yeah, I'm, I'm still learning the nuances of the game. 
Or, you know, when you, you know, when you run, make sure you, you know, jump up and down when you're, like, running. If you don't want to get shot, you know, you can, you know, kind of slide on the ground a little bit when you're going around corners. A lot of cool stuff. And I'm just, I'm just really enjoying learning this game. It's very fluid. It's very smooth. I really, you know, if I was to compare this game and Call of Duty, I, and you can't really compare the two because they're just in completely different realms, but I'd be, like, Battlefield is, like, smooth jazz and Call of Duty is, like, dubstep. You know what I mean? I feel like Call of Duty is really, you know, it's just so twitch and reaction 60 frames per second in your face, and like slamming in you at, you know, 80 miles an hour. In this game, it's like, it's a lot, you know, you gotta be quick, but it's, you know, it's very smooth. Yeah, everything's very smooth. It's like, you know, you're gliding on water. It's, it's very cool. If, you know, if you can follow me on, on that train of thought right there. <laughs> anyway, you can see my A, I'm going in with a pistol, trying to get stuff done, still using my ACR getting stuff done and the I don't know I don't know how the weapon balancing is in this game what I do know is that the ACR and the PP200 are really my cup of tea I I don't know what it is but or the PP2000 whatever whatever it's called I these are my two guns I love these two guns I don't really mess around with anything else the AK12 is pretty good every gun's pretty good but I don't know man the, these guns I don't know if they're overpowered I don't know if they're for noobs, but I just, I really like them. The ACR just shoots so fucking quick. It's fucking beautiful. It really is. See, I did, I did another little bunny hop, but it doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. Anyway, if you guys are having a good time enjoy, enjoying, you know, watching this video, I'm looking for people to play with on Battlefield. So feel free to shoot me a message or just comment. And if you see something that I'm doing wrong, like I'm, I'm really trying to learn this game because I'm probably going to get into it with the, X, you know, Xbox One and... You know, or the 360 really depends on what my budget, you know, allows me to do. But, you know, if there's any Battlefield, you know, pros out there, if you have any tips, tricks, feel free to post them up. You know, I'm humble enough to admit that I'm, I'm by far <laughs> mediocre. So, I'm just trying to get better and give you guys some good content as well. Like, I just learned how to cook a grenade in this game. I, I thought for the I didn't even think in Battlefield 3 you could cook grenades, you know? I thought you had to just, you know, toss them out and see what happens. And I learned today that that's actually not true. <laughs> oh, here we go. Boom. Look at this. That guy should have killed me. He didn't kill me, though. I got my little health pack. And I have heard some people complaining about this game. I don't know what they're saying. I love this game. This game's the shit. If you're not playing this game, what are you doing? I, I you know, I think I'm turning into a Battlefield fanboy. I really do. Call of Duty, you know, it had its day, but I'm really excited for Battlefield 4. I, um, I used to be a competitive player. I used to play at, at MLG events and all that stuff, and Battlefield's never been on the radar. I really hope it is, you know, this, this go-around. But who knows, man? Who knows? Ba you know, Call of Duty, it just, it's just that competitive game. And Battlefield, I don't know if it will be. I know that it has tournaments for it. I know Battlefield is incredibly competitive. But in terms of, like, MLG-type gameplay, I don't know. We'll see, though. I love this game. I don't give a fuck if this game's on MLG or not. I love it. Please, please leave a comment, like, subscribe, all of that cool shit. You guys are fucking cool as fuck. And I hope you have a good day. With that said... I'm out. Peace, and I hope you enjoyed the gameplay.